There are two types of movement in Alice. Movement can be translational or rotational. Translational means that it changes position, but it keeps the same orientation. This type of movement can take one of six directions. Up, down, left, right, forward, and backward. All movements are egocentric, which means that the direction of the movement is from the perspective of the object. Moving left is to the helicopter's left. Moving right is to the helicopter's right. The same applies for rotational movements. For rotational movements, there are two methods, turn and roll. There are four directions for turn. Turn left, turn right, turn forward, turn backward. With rotational movement, the orientation changes, but the position stays the same. The second form of rotational movement is roll. You can roll left, roll right, roll left again. Now let's put it all together with a little simulation of the helicopter moving. The three procedures are here, move, turn, and roll. I can click on a programming tile or a procedure and move it into my code window. I'm going to start by dragging a do in order tile into my code window. There is already a do in order there, but this becomes helpful for copying and pasting later on. I'm going to turn the nose of the helicopter forward by 0.125 complete rotations. Let's examine and see what happens might be a little too far and also my animation starts before I've had a chance to render the screen so scrolling down in the helicopter there's a delay function I'm gonna start with that first delay by a half a second then animate the movement when I do that it renders the screen for that half second and then begins the animation so now I, I need to adjust the rotation forward. I don't need a whole 0.125, so I'm going to enter my own custom decimal number, 0.05. Much better. Now I'm going to move the helicopter forward. When I do that, it moves forward and down at the same time. So it's like I want the helicopter to move forward and up at the same time. To do things together, I need a programming tile called Do Together. So I need that helicopter to move forward 10 meters. And at the same time, it's going to move up. Let's go with 2 meters looks much better. When it reaches this destination, I need it to move back. To copy a programming tile, I can right click on it, select copy to the clipboard. The clipboard is over here. When I click on it and drag it down, it brings a copy of that tile. So now I need to turn backward by the same amount that I turned forward. Let's see what my animation looks like. Turn, move, turn back. I'm now going to roll to my left and move to my left and check it out. It appears that my movement up is not as much as I'd like so I will adjust that. Let's check out the new values. seems to be climbing too much. Not bad. Now for the return flight. I can copy the entire block of code. 
So copying a block of code, whether it be in a do in order or a do together, is pretty handy. Change the directions. Test it. One final tweak. And a final test run. 